Judy. I'm from Glitterpass. Today I'm going to be teaching Black Mirror by One Us. I'm following Lido through most of the dance. I think I watched Huangwoong for the first half and Lido for the second half. So, yep, let's get started. Alright, so we're starting on the 8 before the chorus, and you're just going to jump into this pose. So your right hand is going to be slightly bent and pointing out to the right side. Your left leg is going to be bent and your left, or right leg is going to be bent and your left leg is going to be relatively straight, but you can bend it if you need to hold your balance here. So from here on the one, two, you're going to lean back onto your right foot. At the same time, your head is going to bob to the side, the right side, twice. So that's one, two. On three and, your left foot is going to go toe, heel, inward. So your toe is going to come in, and then your heel is going to come in. So, and then four and, you're going to turn your head forward and then back. Then on five, you're going to hit your left shoulder up, and that's going to initiate you to come Bring your left foot in, bring your right hand down, and land with your hand on your face like so. And your left foot behind your right foot. So just that first part, that's five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, and five, six. From here, your heels are going to be moving, so as you know, or when you cross your feet over each other, make sure your heels are facing outward, so your right heel is facing your left, and your left heel is facing your right. When you do this move, you're going to want to turn your left heel in, so your left heel goes to the left, and then you're going to turn both heels to the right. So that'll be seven, then on eight, you're just going to look to the left. And remember, your left hand is going to be here the whole time, so from here, this will be seven, eight. From the top, that's five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, and five. Six, seven, eight. Alright, so you just finished here on the seven, eight. On the one, you're going to step forward onto your left foot and you're going to kind of run, do this running pose. On two, you're going to start sliding back. Then on three, you're going to hit your right knee up, holding your, hand, your hands in this position. Then on four, you're going to jump onto your toes and straighten both knees and flick your co toes backwards. So from here, this is five. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Then from here on five and your right hand is going to come in front and your left hand is going to come across your chest. And then you're going to open your left hand out as your right hand comes out to this diagonal. Then on six, you're going to bring your right hand down and push your chest in. Then on seven, eight, you're just sliding two times. Or just walking to your new positions. So just the five, six, seven, eight. This is two, three, four. Five and six, seven, eight. From the top, that's five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Alright, so you just ended up sliding on the seven, eight. Now on the one, you're going to step over with your right foot in front of your left to this diagonal. Your left hand is going to come to your stomach and your right hand is going to point out to this diagonal. Then on the two, you bring your right foot out, and then point your left hand to the left diagonal. So this is one, two, on three and four, your right hand's going to come to your chin, turn it to the right side, come back down to your chest, then turn your chest over. So that's three and four, and then you want to immediately start waving your hand like this, like you're dusting off your shoulders, but rolling down your body on and five and. So from the top, that's five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, and on the six, you're going to shoulder your right shoulder forward, and that's going to hit your head to come around as you start bringing your right foot over to the left. So this is and five, and six, and seven, you land on the eight, and you snap your hands, and then on and one, you're going to just pop your chest up and then down. So just that second half, this is three, Four and five and six and seven, eight and one. From the top of that section, it's five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four and five and six and seven, eight and one. All right, so you just ended on the seven, eight and one. Now on the two, three, four, you're going to be stepping right, left, right, left on two, three and four. With your hands at the same time, you're going to cross 
throw a cross in front of you, come around onto your hips. So all together, that'll look like three, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four. From here, you're going to kick ball change, right foot kicked up, step down, left foot comes behind your right knee, and then you're going to turn around and then step back onto your right foot. With the hands, your hands are going to cross in front of you and throw outwards, then they're going to come inwards when you step down, and then when you step back with your left foot, your left hand is going to come to your right shoulder, and then your right hand is going to be down to the side. You spin around, your hands are free, and then you slide off to, onto your right foot, your hands are doing nothing. So just that second half, this is one, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, eight. From the top of that section, this is five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, eight. Alright, so you ended up sliding back onto your right foot. Now on the one, you're going to step out onto your left foot. At the same time, your hands are going to come right hand around your head, left hand cutting straight across. This is one. On two, you're going to step back with your right foot and you're going to slap your hands together. Then on three, four, you're going to step out onto your right and you're going to twist your hands and then come down. So that's five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. On and five, you're going to go right, left, so you're elbowing each direction and you're leaning in the direction that you're elbowing. On and six, you're going to hop back onto your left foot and bring your right foot out and bring your left hand out, palm up in front of you. And then you're going to put your right foot down and bring your left foot up and bring your palm to your face. So that's and five and six. Then on and seven and eight, you're going to bring your left hand down and you're going to jump out like so with your right heel and your left toe on the ground. Bring that in, do the same thing on the other side, and then bring it in. So that second half, this is three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All together from the top, this is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight. All right, so you just finished on the and seven and eight. Then on the one, you're going to bring your hands up and body roll down. Then on two and, you're going to be doing a little shuffle. You're going to have your weight onto your right toe, and it's going to bring, you're going to go out like this. So as your right heel comes out, your left foot is going to come up and also turn your toe outwards. This is one, two and, three and, and each time you're doing it, you're just pointing with your gun. Then on four and, you're going to bring your hands out and then in, tucking your elbows and at your sides as your left hip, foot comes behind your right foot. So this is five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, and four, and. Then on five, six, you're going to jump out. You're going to pull your right hand in on five, and. Then six, and, same thing on the other side. Pull your left hand in. And each time you pull in, your knee is going to come in. So this is right knee, left knee. Then on seven, eight, you're going to cross your hands in front of you and slide off to your left. And then you're going to open up, and then you're going to slam down on eight, and you're going to come down very slightly. So from the four and, this is five and six and seven, eight and. From the top of that section, this is five, six and seven and eight. One, two and three and four and five and six and seven, eight and. Alright, so you just finished here on the 8 and. You really don't have that much time to get down because on the 1, you're going to be kick swinging your right leg out and then uh, hitting your heel inwards. It's kind of like BTS Dynamite if you learn the dance, it's, just, it's literally just the same thing. You swing your right leg out and your left elbow comes out and then you hit your elbow in with your knee and your ankle. This is 1, 2, on 3 and. You're going to jump out and your hands are going to cross over with your right hand on top, left hand down across your waist, and then open, and then four and you're going to put your left hand out, bring your right hand up, and then come down to your crotch. So that's that first part, this is five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four, and on five, six, you're just going to be pelvic thrusting as you jump forward. This is five, 
six. Then on seven, eight, you're going to be leaning towards the left as your hands come to the right. Then to the right as they come to the left. Left, they swing to the right again. Then on and one, you're going to bring your hands forward and then in. And you're going to have your left hand on top, right hand on bottom, palm facing out on the left hand, palm facing in on the right hand. So just that second half from here, this is five, six, seven, eight, and one. From the top of that section, this is five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one. All right, so you just finished on the and one. On the two and, you're just gonna open your hands and come back in. On the three and, you're gonna rotate around. Your left hand is coming up and your right hand is coming down. You're gonna rotate your body with it so that you land in the opposite direction. Right hand on top, palm facing forward. Left hand on the bottom, palm facing in. On the four and, you're just going to rotate these outwards in the windshield wiper motion. So your right hand is coming up into the right diagonal. Left hand is coming down to the left diagonal and then closing again. So that's five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, and four, and. From here, on the five, six, you're going to push your left hand out and to this back diagonal, and you're gonna turn your body with it. Five, six, then on and seven, you're going to bring your hands down and open out towards the left, and you're going to have your left heel on the ground and your toe's gonna to be opening out towards the left as well. Then on eight and one, you're going to bring your toe down then you're going to jump back onto your left foot, and then your right foot's going to come across so that you're facing the left. So just that second half, this is four and five, six and seven, eight and one. From the top of that section, this is five, six, seven, eight and one, two and three and four and five, six and seven, eight and one. All right, now let's go over everything from the top with counts. This is five. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, and six, Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, and one. Yeah. <laughs> 